Better flow. So good. Sunday. Welcome back to another vlog. Today I'm going to be filming a Sunday routine video because we know if you watch my vlogs, I love my Sundays just because to me a Sunday is like very well-rounded. I love to have productivity but also some sense of recharge and like balance mixed in there as well so that I can feel relaxed and just ready for the week ahead. So today I'll go grocery shopping, do some laundry. Honestly, I'll probably go for a walk this morning and listen to a podcast. I'm craving the idea of that. It sounds so nice. I will usually go for a walk or a workout on a Sunday. It depends how my body's feeling and what I kind of did the week before. So that's kind of what's up today. And then later this afternoon, I'm gonna grab a coffee with a friend. I'll usually do that again, either in the morning or the afternoon. It's just a little part of our Sunday routine. So that's what I got going on today. And I just wanted to bring y'all through different things that I like to do and how I kind of set myself up for the week ahead. And obviously like some self-care and everything mixed within there. But we're gonna make the cold brew and then get started on the to-do list. For my cold brew this morning, I just used the La Colombe Extra Bold Cold Brew. I typically switch between this one and then the Busy Cold Brew, which I love. I'm almost out of this, so I need some more today when I go to the grocery store. And then I always froth a creamer and then some oat milk. So this is the oat milk vanilla flavor. I love this brand because there's such minimal ingredients. And then I use a tiny bit of the Shivani coffee creamer. I love to get fresh air in the morning, so I brought my planner out here and my coffee and I'm just gonna make my to-do list. Chilling on the balcony this morning. Also my pajama set is from Gilly Hicks. It's so freaking cute. They have a major summer sale going on so I got this during their sale and I've been living in it ever since I got it. I also got so many new like activewear pieces so I'll show you guys that. ready for my walk this morning. I'm going to finish up my greens and then we'll head on out. But this is the outfit of the day. I'm wearing some biker shorts. These are like my go-to in the summer. I love biker shorts and these ones from Gilly Hicks are amazing. Also, you can definitely hear my laundry in the back, so ignore that. And then a ribbed sports bra. You guys know I love my ribbed material, especially for my workout clothes. Super flattering. I was in the store the other day and picked up a bunch of pieces because I just could not get enough of this little workout set. And I was like, holy crap, I did not realize how great of a sale they had going on. Everything is up to a 50% off. And then I have a special code for you guys. So you can get an additional 20% off your purchase. So you can save yourself literally so much money. And they have more than just activewear. They have like sleepwear. The pajamas I was wearing earlier are from Gilly Hicks. Yeah, I've just been living in their stuff recently because it's cute, affordable, and really functional as well. 
So that's what we got going on today. I'm gonna finish up my greens and we'll go for a little walk. the day and now I'm deciding between which outfit I should wear. I have two exercise dresses because these are quite literally my favorite thing in the summertime. Not only do you feel super comfortable and look cute, but you just feel put together. Something about these, amazing. So if you don't have one, I 100% recommend them. So I have these two from Gilly Hicks. I love them both so much. I don't know which one I want to wear today. I'm kind of leaning towards this black one. I wore this a couple weeks ago at the farmer's market and I love them. They're like my go-to Farmer's Market attire, running errands attire. They're so cute. So I'm gonna run my errands after I grab coffee with my friends. So we'll just like go to the grocery store and stuff. So I think I'm just gonna do this all black one. But I'll try it on and let you guys know which outfit before we head on out. For the outfit today, I just decided on the black mini dress. So stinking cute. Like you can't tell me this isn't the best little exercise dress you've ever seen. And I checked online, it's $30. So totally take advantage of the sale and also like I said I have an additional 20% off code that you can use on top of the sale I'm always finding you all the deals I swear so I'll have this exact dress linked down below I love it I shared it on my Instagram story so hopefully it's not sold out yet you guys that's why I'm like take advantage of it so cute but I'm gonna head out grab some coffee and then after that we'll go head to the grocery store and run some errands <music> finished up at Costco, now let's head to Publix. We're back home with the grocery haul. I'll run through everything that I got. So. Starting with Costco, this is where I pretty much get like all of my veggies and everything just because they come in bulk and I go through them like crazy. The broccoli, Brussels sprouts, spring mix, rice cauliflower. This week I wanna make taco bowls, so I got romaine hearts for that and then ground chicken, some strawberries for my oatmeal or yogurt parfaits in the morning or just to like snack on. I've also been craving apples and peanut butter for a snack lately, so I picked up some apples, little honey crisp apples, some yogurts. These Chobani yogurts are my favorite. I love the milk and cookies one. And I don't know why, but they have a pumpkin spice flavored out and I love pumpkin spice, so I got that. And then some Olipop. Y'all know Olipop is my fave. Lots of bananas. These protein bars, the maple glazed donut flavor, so good from the brand one. I just like having protein bars on hand for those days where I'm like really busy, need a quick snack, those are easy. Some nut thins and then just some Ziploc baggies and just soap. Oh, and then of course, my favorite coffee, this Busy Cold Brew is the best. You guys know I love it. I feel like I rave about it all the time. And then some salad dressing. So I'm gonna put all the groceries away and then we'll get to tidying up the apartment. into some sweats and a little tank 
Now that the garage is put away and all my bedding is back together, I'm going to tidy and clean up the apartment. To me, it's just so therapeutic to clean my apartment because obviously I like work from home, so I like to have a very organized and neat space, especially before going into the week, just because it makes me feel so less chaotic and stressed. And I just feel like I operate so much better and just like feel in better flow when my apartment is organized. So I'm gonna get to cleaning a little bit. I'm gonna start probably with my bathroom, just like wipe down all the counters and everything and then get to putting away like my dishes and cleaning the kitchen, all of that. put together and like cozy and homey like flowers do plus it just gives so much life and color to the space and Trader Joe's has the best selection so I'm gonna go pick those up and then once I get back home all that I really have left to do in terms of cleaning my apartment is just vacuuming washing the floors and then putting my laundry away and then we're good to go and we'll do some self-care tonight I'll probably sauna definitely need to shower and wash my hair a little face mask all the things For dinner i made a shrimp salad and then i used this dressing that i got earlier today so good this raspberry vinaigrette it definitely like makes the salad and it tastes so summery you got the shrimp i roasted brussels sprouts and broccoli in the air fryer and then just threw everything over a bed of greens so good
little bit later. Obviously, I'm all freshened up and everything. I'm just ice rolling my face a little bit before I head to bed tonight because early this week, I have my second microneedling treatment. So leading up to the treatment, I like to give my skin like all the extra TLC. It just really makes sure that my skin is super hydrated and cared for because it's definitely more of like a drying treatment. Like your skin can get very dry and scaly following the treatment like two to three days after. But last time I actually didn't experience that and I know that it's because I gave my skin lots of hydration and like care before the treatment. So I did a little face mask tonight and I'm just ice rolling because it feels so good. And I feel like it also helps like calm my skin as well. I don't know, it could just be a placebo thing, but I love it. So I'm going to wrap up the vlog here because I'm pretty much heading to bed. Right now I have an early day tomorrow and I'm probably gonna vlog the whole week like a little week in my life vlog so i'm gonna end off with this video here i hope you guys enjoyed my sunday routine i love you all so much and i'll see you in my next video bye guys